until there's a microphone that has reached you. Go ahead, gentlemen. Marnik. Felicia, you brought your uh, Dolby score with you. Are there any players that are not available tomorrow? Yes, uh, I take... Uh, I take everybody because uh, I I think that uh, it's a great moment for uh, for the club for the all the players. So uh, uh, my desire was that uh, everybody was here. Yes, all the players. Uh, no, but injured injured players. Only no. only here. Only here. Yeah. Yes, our friend from Norway. <laughs> Hi, question for the coach. Uh, Sander, was your captain for the first time last game. Uh, at such a young age, how, Im how impressed are you with his uh, leadership qualities and, and uh, his, his footballing qualities as well, of course? Yes, um, I think, uh, like, like you, you said, that it's a young player, but it's a great player. Um, he's uh, one of uh, the more intelligent of my group, tactical. So uh, it's a leader in the dressing room when uh, when he wants uh, to speak, when he wants uh, to give uh, some information, it's a good feeling for me. So, uh, yes, he's important for the team. So it's the reason that last week uh, I gave him a uh, captain. We only have one mic, or is there a second mic? Otherwise, we're going to have to... Okay, uh, Marnik. Um, yeah, Felicia. Oh. Um, there's a... a Marnik, yes. Oh, okay, Felicia, there's a, a, a very important week coming up uh, for the club, also for you uh, personal. Do you feel the, the pressure? So, um, yes, it's an important game. Uh, it's an important moment, I know, but uh, uh, no, I don't feel uh, the pressure. I know that uh, it's not a, a, mom a moment so easy, but um, I, uh, I work like uh, in the past, I, I try... Uh, to, to give my best, the focus for me is to work with my with my team, with my group, and to give uh, my best. And uh, the communion between us uh, and me is important. And uh, until I feel uh, this situation, uh, I'm so I'm I'm easy to work. So uh, I know that uh, the results are not uh, are not so good. I know that uh, the way that we play is not so good. But um, okay, I um, I work in the same way that in the beginning. So uh, for this. Uh, okay, I'm I'm calm. Um, do you feel that um, uh, a lot of things went wrong against Urban? Do you feel you can um, yeah, do it in another way with the with, with this group? And and do you feel that the players already also uh, know that it, that was not good uh, on, on Saturday? <coughs> it's sure that I feel that uh, we can play another way. Uh, if uh, I not feel this, uh, I cannot be here this evening and tomorrow. So uh, I feel that we can change because uh, it's not possible uh, to play a second game like we play against uh, uh, Open. It's the first thing. The second thing is that the mental will be different. We play uh, against uh, the, great, uh, the best team, I think, in the world for the moment. Uh, we play uh, the situation. It's, it's different. So uh, I'm sure that in the mental, the, the players... Uh, will be better tomorrow, and uh, I hope the coach also. Stan? Is this for your players a moment to, let, to, to forget completely about the Belgian Championship and, and just enjoy themselves and, and play the best football they can play, or how do you see it? Yes, yes, it's the moment. Uh, to enjoy, but to enjoy, not uh, to be here, to take photos, to look the publics, to look uh, uh, the media. It's uh, to enjoy, uh, to, to give the, the life on the pitch and to play the best football as possible. It's important because uh, um, they, 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 they play a big game uh, against uh, a big team. Perhaps, perhaps uh, one time in our, li our life, uh, a game like this in this pitch show, it's important to enjoy, but to play, to play and to give uh, our life. Uh, 
Coach, what have you learned from uh, the first game against Liverpool, the loss at home? What have you learned from that? The first thing uh, that uh, that we learn is that uh, we have some opportunity, some chances. So it's important uh, that we believe that you can do uh, good things. Uh, so we we learn also that uh, uh, it's a, a good a good team with a lot of uh, good players, and uh, they can. Uh, do the difference individual uh, with uh, technical movement and uh, okay uh, we know we know uh, that it's a great team uh, the the most important now it's uh, to have a, a good organization and uh, yes good transition and uh, to believe it, to believe in us Felice okay. aren't you a, a bit disappointed in your players until now Sorry, I have no Aren't you a bit disappointed in your players until now when you look back on the past no, seasons? No, I'm. Uh, I cannot say that I'm disappointed. Uh, it, it's, it's not the, the good word. Uh, so I'm not happy uh, the way that we play. So uh, it's also my responsibility. It's too easy to say I'm disappointed with uh, with my players. It's also my responsibility. So I try to improve. Myself and I try that my players improve each other. Ingrid, I know your name now. A <laughs> <laughs> uh, question for the coach: um, What can you say about the position that the club are in now versus last year? Are you now in a rebuilding phase? You've lost a bit of a players from last season. How would you say that the club? Where are you now? Yes, <laughs> but I think when uh, when a club uh, is champion, uh, you know that uh, if you are a champion, you have uh, a lot of good players, and you know that uh, the the season after you, you cannot keep all the players. So it's a normal situation. So now we know that the team it's not the same, but uh, it's not an excuse for me because. Uh, uh, in the beginning of the season, I was agree with this group. So now, now if uh, the the moment it's the difficult, I, I must say that I agree with this group also. So it's like this: we must work, 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 and try to improve. There are some doubts about the system with two strikers. How do you feel about this? Are you thinking about changing it again to one striker and, and two wingers, or or not really? Perhaps uh, we can play with three strikers tomorrow. I don't know. Yes, uh, in some moments uh, when we play with two strikers, uh, we had seen some good situation. Um, the the game against Open uh, was not good with two strikers. Perhaps because the the pitch uh, was little and uh, we create not enough space. So it's I think it's one of the the reason uh, with. Uh, then we need more aggressivity, we know this, but uh, okay, the problem it's not uh, only that we play with uh, two strikers, uh, we, need, we need more mentality, uh, we need more aggressivity. Uh, it's for me the, the first reason. Bert. Sander. I know that you're a player who likes the Premier League a lot. Are you impressed when you see all this, this club? See what? Are you impressed when you see all this as a player who likes the Premier League? See the press, you mean, or what? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> the club, the stadium. I mean, in general, the club, the stadium, everything. Yeah, I haven't seen much. I just came, but uh, of course, to play at Anfield. I never thought I would do with uh, Genk. But uh, when I'm first here with this young group and talented group, I'm, uh, I'm happy to be here with uh, my guys. You know, I was a part of the team that won the championship and brought us here. So it's a big dream coming true to, to play the best team in the world at the moment. Uh, of course, in Anfield is something special. Sam, how was the atmosphere in the group um, after Open? Do you all realize that the, um, that, that performance was, was just not good enough, that, that there was not enough uh, chemistry um, in the team, and that has to be, uh, yeah, that you have to do it in another way tomorrow? It was not uh, the strongest performance at all, but it's easy to take the quick uh, uh, conclusion that we were not playing so well last year. Uh, uh, when we played and we won the league, uh, we were struggling for 90 minutes against Open, but we were efficient in the boxes and scored two goals early, so we could sit back and defend. And, and nobody talks how you play. Uh, this year we dominate for 30 minutes, we don't score. They score two times on two set pieces. 
then everybody speaks that we're not so good. So all in all, I mean, we've dominated quite some games this year, but we haven't been had uh, what you say the experience and uh, what is needed in the big boxes. Uh, that there's what the game decides if the results. And uh, at the moment, we're struggling a little bit there because uh, we lack a little bit what you say the discipline and the leadership to 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 make the dominant uh, and big solutions uh, to handle them in our own box and of course when we first come into the the 16 yard box we're we're not really there because i think we had three four big chances to score that goal and uh, that's game changing in today's football if you cannot take your moments I feel a lot of um, uh, responsibility also um, towards the yeah 3000 fans that coming up uh, for this game from gang uh, for uh, the game here yeah, of course. So you always play for the fans uh, to and have this moment with the fans playing in Anfield. Uh, that's uh, huge, and they're known here for having the be- maybe the best fans in the world and their twelfth man in the- their back. So, yeah, we will uh, enjoy it, but also make sure we'll uh, do better than last time. Uh, I thought we did a good game la- last time, except uh, the scoreline in the end. But for seventy-five minutes, it was a game, and obviously, Champlain scored two. Two good goals outside 16. Uh, it's difficult to play Liverpool on a day that they scored those type of goals. Uh, but except that, uh, we were into the game. We, we played the, the game way. We had a good block. Of course, we had respect for our opponents. They're dominating the game. But all in all, I think we were compact. We were strong. We were aggressive. And we did what we could. Keith. So, Sander, you're a captain now. Does it change anything for you? Uh, I think I tried to be that uh, take that leadership role for the uh, last two years, more or so. I took it more and more over in the, when Clément took over because I grew more into that role. Uh, I felt comfortable in the group and uh, I felt I had the respect from everybody. So uh, I've been able to, to speak more and take more uh, leadership on and off the pitch and make sure everybody feels home here. Uh, and of course, it was a proud moment to play my 100 cap and uh, captain the team Uh, and that's okay you feel something special when you wear the armband but all in all I try to do the same job every game no matter if I have the armband or not Stan this morning the president told us that some players are not reaching their normal level for the moment how do you feel about that personally and is the group realizing that also yeah, I think everybody when you're playing in the Champions League Cup, I'm I'm quite pretty sure that everybody knows if they're not having a good game or uh, a, a bad, yeah, or playing good. Uh, so I'm pretty sure. Like I think I've become better and better throughout the, the weeks and months. I started out uh, slowly uh, and we're not at my best level in the beginning of the season. Uh, but then I gr- gradually improved my game and uh, the last couple of weeks in uh, both national team in the Champions League and in the league. Uh, been at my level, uh, level and improved my game. So uh, yeah, I think we're quite sure when we we're not playing at our best. But of course, we changed some uh, players in our team, and uh, we're trying to find the best solution to to win games at the moment. I mean, the team that won the league played together for two years, uh, and the automatism in the team was was there without even thinking, you know. You could say, like, yeah, the tactics were great, but, I mean, me, Mali, Posto, Leandro, Samata, we played together all the time. So uh, it's new players and we have to adapt to each other and make sure we become even better than the, the team that played last year. Last two questions, please, if there are any left. Magnik. Some of the coach talked about uh, um, more aggressive. Uh, you have to be more aggressive uh, on the pitch uh, as a team. Uh, is that something you talked about with the players uh, uh, in the dressing room? Yeah, totally. Our strength in the team, the, and of course, which is the, one of the strengths in the gank DNA, is to recuperate the ball the fastest possible way. You know, we want to be dominant and have the ball yeah, mostly all the time. And when we don't have it, we have to be. We're, we're known for being uh, strong in the first five seconds to, to, uh, to win the ball back. And uh, this year we haven't been really aggressive enough, uh, enough there. And too many games, it has been equal in terms of uh, yeah, the possession. And uh, too many times the opponent has been allowed of playing out their own back. Yeah, so yeah, I agree. Yeah. Last one for, uh, for the coach. Um, it's it's uh, very difficult now to to see with which team um, uh, Mr. Klopp uh, will play. He has a lot of uh, um, ways to play, a lot of players uh, available. Um, makes it more difficult uh, for you. 
because they have a big game on, on Sunday, maybe he will rotate or maybe not. Um, does it make a big difference in your preparation of the game? So, um, yes, when, uh, when you have only two days to, to prepare a game and uh, you know that uh, it's after a game that uh, you have played, it's not uh, the same thing that when you have a week, but uh, you must adapt and, uh, okay, you must uh, do uh, the choice. It's uh, my life. Huh? Uh, I think it's the most important point of my, my life, like a coach, it's uh, to make choice. So uh, I will do a choice. I, perhaps we change something. Perhaps not, uh, we will see, but uh, okay, it's like this. We know we know that this situation in the beginning of the season with all the games that we must play. So okay, it's not so easy, but it's not so difficult. It's my job. Yeah, the way that Paul will play, uh, does that interest you or this player? Do you play? I, I don't understand your... Uh, ah, Klopp, okay. What the, the word I don't understand. Yes, I think that the club uh, play uh, every time uh, with uh, the same system. So um, we we know perhaps he changed some players. I know that uh, uh, he have a, an important game in uh, in the league, the next game against uh, City. So perhaps he change one of two of three players. Uh, we don't know, but uh, even if he change, uh, we know that uh, they are good players. So the the thing that uh, we are sure that uh, the system it's, uh, and the philosophy it's the same. Thank you, coach. Thank you, Sander. Thank you all. Have a good night. See you tomorrow.